It's not my penthouse tonight because it's been turned into the barracks. It's finally I've had the opportunity to have the Sarge over. And Sarge, one, welcome to the house. And, you know, it's really been great for, for the two of us, being the friends we are, to be part of the LPWA from its very inception. And I've been amazed at the phenomenal success all across the country that the LPWA is enjoying. Well, Ken, you know, you're talking about the uh, elite female wrestlers in the world today. The major league of professional ladies wrestling is right here in the LPWA. Sarge, let me ask you, you've held numerous titles throughout your legendary career, but you had to work awfully, awfully hard for them. Were you as surprised as I was when the LPWA Championship Committee just decided to give Superstar Sexton the belt, basically, on a silver platter? Well, at first I was a little upset about it, but uh, she's uh, been around wrestling for a long time, and uh, she's proven herself. This is uh, about eight weeks now she's held the belt, and uh, she's still winning, so she's a uh, proven champion. There's no question, like her style, we've got to give credit where credit is due, and she's one of the great tacticians in the game today. I mean, you could tell she's always thinking two, three moves ahead. Of course, she's uh, always looking ahead, and uh, like you said, she's a great uh, knowledge wrestler. She knows what's going on, and she can mix it up real bad if she wants to and get real down and dirty. You know, Sarge, the next couple of weeks here should be just I incredible as the tag team tournament comes into full force. A lot of top teams competing for that title. Sure is. Uh, I'm kind of leaning toward the, uh, the Glamour Girls. I think they've got it all together. They've been together for a long time, and they know each other like the back of their hand, and uh, they don't have to even talk to each other. They know what the other one's going to do, and I, I kind of tend to think that they might take the title. Well, we'll find out if experience can win over speed and quickness. By the way, Sarge, congratulations. G.I. Joe, still the number one selling toy. Yeah. Any special messages for the kids out there? Yes. Keep those chins up, those chests out, and never let the enemy eat your breakfast. Yo, Joe, USA, number one. The Sarge. Let's talk a little bit about Medusa. Oh, you Medusa fans, let me tell you, you're flogging a dead horse. And I do mean a horse. She used to be in Japan, and she should have stayed in Japan with the rest of the cows. I'm the champion because I'm beautiful. I'm not some big, butch-looking broad like Medusa. I'm gorgeous. She can't wrestle. She can only mince around the ring. If you want to back Medusa, you back Medusa. Be a loser all your life, like her. Got a problem with it? Call me. Hey, America, this is bad, she's black, and of course, I'm beautiful. Just a minute. It's not about who's black. They know I'm black. It's about who's the best, and we are the best, do you understand? And when you're the best, there's no room for the rest. That's absolutely true. And we're here, of course, to address fan mail. And our attitude about fan mail is keep it. We're the best, we should be the best, and we are the best. And if you have eyes and you can see, You'll know where we're the best. And there'll be no need to write and ask questions. It's very, very self-explanatory. Can we elaborate a little bit more, Venus? You see this? That's what's going to put it away. You see this? That's what's going to put them away. We'll walk out of the air with the belts around our waist. That's what it's all about. It's power. It's strength. It's blackness. It's bold. It's beautiful. And it's always beautiful when you're wearing the gold. Because the gold is bold, and we're very cold. Welcome to LPWA, Hold of the Week. This week we'll be looking at the double wrist lock takedown. Now for a minute, let's go to the center of the ring and take a look at exactly how the double wrist lock takedown occurs. You have both women in a squared off professional stance, or open stance. From that point, you d they go into their professional tie-up. From this point, offensive wrestler moves about the right hand, comes around, up, over, slides down onto the wrist. From this point, she comes across with her left hand, threading over the top of the arm, coming back through and locking onto her own wrist, which makes it the double wrist lock. From this point, she will go into a backward roll, taking her opponent all the way through and complete. Now let's take a look at the double wrist lock takedown in one continuous motion. And the move is complete. And there you have it from LPWA, Hold of the Week. We'll return to LPWA action from Laughlin, Nevada, home of the beautiful Colorado Bell Hotel and Casino.
Hear about it? A big new Payments of just nine ninety six. Save forty six percent off the cover price. Tuesday night at eight o'clock for live coverage of the showdown between the two lane green. You know something? What a I, great time to pick up the phone and give us a call, right? I know it. Now we can't tell you what you won't believe. It. Trust me. If you give us a call, one nine hundred two three four L P W A, we will. You, trust me, you just won't believe it. I wish we could tell them on TV that we could get in trouble, but it's something you talk about some hot gossip in the L P W A. In fact, every time you give us a call, you'll be surprised about what you'll learn. That's right, and kids, it's top secret. So you know what that means? Pick up the phone, ask mom and dad to dial it for you if you don't know how. And give us a call. And on, that's an order. That's an order. In fact, you'll get a chance to hear all the inside scoops in the LPWA, not only from the sergeant myself, but you'll hear from a lot of your fan favorites and talk about colorful, who more colorful than Miss Linda and exotic Adrian, a couple of that are people that are never at a loss for words. Am I right? I'll kiss you or I'll kick you. No, you I won't. Like the best. I'm as tough as Marciano and as sexy as Mae West, as cute as Shelley Temple and as fast as Bruce Lee. I could kill a man. Eventually, call us.